Knicks come into their matchup with the Miami Heat, just a game back of the Atlanta Hawks for the final playoff spot in the East, but New York faces a playoff team in each of their remaining games. It's a fast start for the Knicks, though. They get going with J.R. Smith missing, but hustling on the offensive boards, the Knicks get it back over to Smith, who buries the three, and we have a theme alert for you. Meanwhile, this is a Shaq to the Fool nominee right here. LeBron James did have some trouble in the first quarter with turnovers. There's one. Here is another for LeBron just tossing it out of bounds. He had four turnovers in the opening 12 minutes. Meanwhile, off the Carmelo Anthony miss, LeBron managed to do some good in that first quarter. Gets wrapped up on the play, but strong enough to get it in, and here's what LeBron said. Uh, I don't know, I'll do a little work in the weight room, I guess. A little bit. <laughs> a little work in the right room. A little work is what LeBron says. Yeah, the world is jealous for the king is strong inside on this one as well. Throwing it down with power into the second quarter now, and it's Ray Allen knocking down the three. That kept the 17 to one run for the Miami Heat. They're up 34-26, Carmelo Anthony working on Shane Battier. Pulls up and hits the jumper. That's the good, the bad. He was just four of 17 from the field in the game. He got the and one on that play, but he had just 13 points. Iman Shumpert to J.R. Smith. He was five of eight from distance in the first half. The Knicks led it 50 to 48 at the break. Third quarter, defensive miscommunication leaves. Yeah, LeBron James, of all people in the world, you want to leave wide open in the paint. There's LeBron, and he throws that one down. He was 13 of 22 from the field. Miami up by four now. 13.3 seconds left in the quarter. Shot clock turned off. The Knicks could have waited for the last shot. They don't. Melo just chucks up a shot that's long, and we go the other way. LeBron finds time to get this shot off with four seconds left in the quarter and the foul. He had 38 points on the game. Miami. Up 73-64 after the made free throw. Then, fourth quarter, LeBron burying a three as the shot clock buzzer sounds. He was three of seven from range. Back the other way, there's J.R. Smith pulling up on a three. It's his 21st three over the last three games. That's an NBA record. Then Raymond Felton to J.R. Smith again. Another three. It's 94-88. Here come the Knicks closing the gap. J.R. Smith, does he have another one? Yes, he does. It's a franchise record, 10 three-pointers made, also an NBA record. J.R. Smith took 22 threes in the game, but Chris Bosh had an answer. Nails the three-pointer there, and Miami defends their home court. They win it by 11, 102 to 91.